want to make some very brief points. Um, I welcome Mr. Burrell's reference to the Temporary Protection Directive 2001, uh, which is there to cope uh, when uh, member states are struggling with an asylum surge, but it has never been used. Um, and it depends on voluntary efforts by member states. So I'm delighted that Mr. Burrell is putting it up to uh, the EU Council. And I think that we need to identify safe and legal pathways. We need to coordinate, of course, with the United Kingdom. Um, the definition of a refugee is having a well-founded fear of persecution and no greater demonstration of that could be had than people clinging to the wheels of an aeroplane. So we need to look at this not as a EU border security issue, as some EU member state leaders have done, but as an Afghan humanitarian issue. And I joined with the consensus that our priority after evacuation should be for sending a strong message to women and girls uh, of our support and solidarity. Uh, I, I'm sorry to say that female emancipation was a useful and now discarded fig leaf for US and NATO adventurism. Uh, and, it, and it is uh, extremely disappointing. Finally, uh, David and Thomas, uh, I would join with Petra, Petras Astrovikias in his call for an extraordinary session of the European Parliament to address this. The UK Parliament met, met this week, other parliaments have met, and uh, I think it would be highly appropriate for us to underline the urgency of this by, uh, by calling for a session of the European Parliament. Thank you, David.